not only is it a, it could be a character-based matchup, but you know, these players do, like, you know, yep. it depends on their skill that they bring. Yes. I mean, even witnessing earlier, we had a DDD that was going pretty, pretty, pretty well in bracket. Yeah, and DDD's kind of bad. <laughs> So now we got the real match this time around. Yes. No mistake, no nothing like that. We're getting into well, a MTW and Venom. Regular Kalos, so I guess that was the issue. Oh, okay, there was no platforms. I didn't even get to see that. Yeah, they were on Omega first. So, this, so far we've already seen a very slow start from this because they've both been trying to wait for an opening. They've both been trying to wait for a really solid opening. And they haven't really been getting anything too much. You've seen a couple basic conversions so far, but mostly it's just been that battle poking. Yeah, and so far they're still both filling each other out, you know, both even percentages at right now, but, uh, you know, still trying to see what, what one's got to offer. They haven't really done anything major yet, no big moves, no uh, combos into deaths yet. Still kind of like, you know, it's like, hey, how you doing? It's a, they're introducing yeah. themselves right now. Just feeling each other out a little bit, nothing, nothing, too, nothing too big yet. Now, Professor MGW, though, starting to get a bit of a lead growing here. It's not much of one, but if we're going to play a slow-paced match like this, then leads like that matter a lot. Mm -hmm. One thing I just thought I want to point out is if MGW can keep getting these water shuriken pokes, that's going to tear away at Arsene. Arsene's going to start draining away really fast. And in a match like this, Arsene's huge because early kills like are that? such a momentum shift just like that. Wow. And now MGW's at such a pretty sizable deficit. If I mean, he can't make something happen quick, Sugar Ninja can kill now, but mm -hmm. still, like everyone knows how he kills now, down down to up smash. Yeah, Professor NGW is not out of it yet. You know, he still can build up the damage, can still get this kill very quickly, but um, right now Venom's not making it easy at all, putting on some more damage, and some more damage at 50% already is MGW. Yeah, this lead's starting to grow way too big. MGW's gotta do something soon to make something change. You know, Venom slowly starting to run away with this game. Yeah, eventually W's got to do something, and he's got to do it now right now. Catch that air dodge, and now that would have been huge. All right, still not catching the air dodge. Never mind, he got it that time. Oh Down so forward air, get the kill. 50% deficit. That's not too bad at all. That's definitely something it, he can work with. It definitely. Now, let's see how much he can take advantage of this uh, of this deficit and make it back into even. But um, Venom's not going to make it easy at all. Apparently, yeah, Venom's not letting up even after dropping the stock there. Both still filling each other out a little bit, nothing too big. Oh, that's a lot of our sense from that forward air. It's a meaty move. And there we go, it's like he's just chipping away right now, just inching, inching closer to make it, like look at that, 10%, uh, oh, well, a little bit more of a difference now. Ooh, and now uh, uh, Venom's, Venom's, still trying to, uh, Venom's still trying to just keep this lead going, even when it was starting to get a little close. Now we have this huge 50% gap again. Yeah, and uh, yeah, MGW is in a little bit of trouble right now. He's gotta be extra careful. MGW finally Ooh. trying to try to wait out these air dodges, but Venom mixing it up finally. And losing Arsene is a big deal now, so now it's going to yes. be a little bit harder for uh, Venom to get this stock. He still can. Joker still has ways of pressuring, like off stage getting Gimps, and his smash attack is still Ooh. very strong without Arsene. But it's definitely going to be a lot harder to get a kill without him. All right, we see him going for these back airs, trying to get a nice, quick, safe kill. Not going to be able to get it though, and MGW covering these air dodges again. Pretty much evening up the game. Ooh, Ooh. that down smash, though, that's gonna take that stock. This is starting to cut a little bit of issue. Oh, Never right. mind, we got even. last stock game. We got even game here. Game one, start out the set. One stock apiece, how's it gonna go down? And so far, like, it's, Venom has a great start at every stock he's taken uh, from Professor MGW. And, uh, you know, it, it's a, it, you know, of course he starts well, but at the end, it's it's been even. Like, it's been back and forth, back and forth. It's like, who's going to take this last stock right now? It seems like MBW is in trouble, but again, he can't count him out right now. Not at all. Especially with a character like Greninja. Greninja has a lot of loops. Greninja has a lot of really extensive combos that can do quite a bit. Oh my goodness, Oh, please. that was... <laughs> oh all right, trying to shake everyone up a little bit. I like even, it, I like it. Even shook him up. No He's fear. No fear. <laughs> Even though he's showing some fear, there's no fear. <laughs> oh my goodness, okay. Got a little further off stage right now. Keeping him away, keeping him away. Huge. One oh. big issue about our send is that recovery. Really easy to catch. Ooh. Very easy to catch that recovery. And again, we're back to neutral. Ooh, oh my goodness, no way. With the up smash, not gonna get okay. the stock yet though. Thought so. 
Oh. This is selling cut really close. And oh he's got to do something soon if he wants it. He's not going to get it. Uh. Getting up off of that. This man is active. I like it. This man cares. This man has emotions. <laughs> yeah, my man is dancing in the camera right now. I like it. He's got passion. That's why he's so good. That's why he's here right now. Mm -hmm. Playing against Venom, trying to get out of this pool. Venom is going to hold his own at least, pretty well the entire game, honestly. At least he wants to get out of this pool on winner side, for yes. sure. That's, that's the key thing. Yeah. Um, but Venom was doing a really good job the entire game of just holding a lead and just continuing to pressure. Mm -hmm. Never letting anything get to him, never really letting up, keeping that pressure on pretty much the whole game. In the end, he got the kill with it. He was able to catch MGW slipping a little bit, got the kill with that down smash, and that's it. Like yeah. the fans are Lila and Yoshi's. Yeah, and MGW's to uh, having a nice conversation with the crowd right now. Crowd interaction. It, that's, that's not with New York City right now. And of course, it's a New York City crowd. They're backing up their boy right now. Of course, of course. And, and like, you can hear some of the again? crowd. That's what I want. I want to hear the crowd. All right, going into game two here. Venom up 1 0. So, but it was FD a very pick. close game one. Yes, FD. I do like this pick. Because, well, yes, MGW was using those platforms a lot to get a lot of catches. He was able to use the flat space in the middle very well to keep his space. And so far, he's going to be doing it again. Nice down to dash attack up to match. I don't think I've ever seen that from a Greninja before. That was, that was a good conversion. Nice, decent chunk of damage. <laughs> but stand, then he gets shot twice. Just <laughs> yeah, stood there and took it. BW's starting to get a little bit frustrated, it looks like, though. Yeah, you can tell by his emotions right there. He's shaking yeah. his head. Nice Good tag. Good Not tech. dying yet. At 104, too, man. He's making this a little uh, it's a little rough right now. Maybe the FD pick wasn't right. <laughs> Venom definitely is showing comfort on the stage. Wow. Good stuff by Venom to, to absorb that to get the Arsene a lot quicker. And that back is going to be it. 60%. MDW's got to do something soon. Can't keep getting tilted like this. We can see mm -hmm. it with the way he's moving, the way he's acting, and it's never a good thing. It never helps anyone. Yeah, my man's definitely wearing his emotions on his sleeve. He is showing everything. And, yeah. just, and Venom, not, yeah, just chill. He's a chill dude right now. Playing, he's playing, playing Joker. Nice, cool, calm, and collected. That's sometimes the way you got to be. Especially with a character like Joker. Joker does require a lot of patience, believe it or not. This character requires you knowing how to get an opening and against your opponent, you're not gonna get anything done. Oh my goodness. Catch okay. Attack all, catching him on ledge, getting that four after cleaning out the stock. No, it's even stocks, not even 10 percentages whatsoever. That's all. There's a hell of a hill to, uh, for GW to climb. I think Greninja does still have some really good early kill options. He can push Venom off stage and just push him back too far. He can also, you know, down throw up smash, it's there. Nair up smash, also there. Not as reliable, I guess, in this sense, because Venom knows it's there too. Everyone knows it's there. Okay. But it is, that doesn't mean it's not. It's still huge. All right. <laughs> we got pressure. <laughs> don't, don't mind me. I'm, that, that man is moving. That's nah, all I'm saying. Nah, you're right. He is. <laughs> that, Ooh, that's that's unfortunate. I'm so Slipping, sorry. but still unfortunate. Back off stage. <laughs> GW's got to get something on soon. Arsen is here. He's got to oh. get something happening soon, or it's going to be the end of him. But so far, I've noticed Venom has really only been able to get the stocks with Arsen for the most part. I mean, he was able to get a couple down smashes last game without him. Yeah, at the end. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. So he definitely doesn't need Arsen, but Arsen definitely helps. And that's, that's not even a Venom thing. That's just a Joker thing. That Ooh. was attackable. Yeah. And attackable, I mean, so MGW was uh, coaching that, but that was, that was way too close to tech. That's, that was, yeah. that, you know. Can't do much I mean, about that. I'm not a fan of untackables, but it, it, you got to deal with it. But now, it yeah. Happens, it's there. You can't deny it. Yeah, right now, MGW's got to turn it up. He definitely needs to get this the percentage up. He needs to get the stock. He needs to even it up, like, right now. Uh, missing oh. up the drive down conversion. Oh, and he's having a whole it's conversation with himself, and he's dropping the, yep. these combos. He knows he, what the mistakes he's making. He's got to do something. He's got to change up something soon. His game plan is just not. Whatever he's trying to do has not been working. And it shows that's not working. Venom saw it. He knows what's happening. He's definitely beating him out for it. Mm, down tilting under that Greninja F tilt. Okay. Ooh, okay. Nice aggressive. Is this going to happen? Oh, my goodness. He's going off stage. He's trying to push it. And he's got to be careful. The Arsene is it's almost there. Oh. All right. I, one thing I like right now that MGW started doing 
Is he start playing a lot more? Oh. Defense? Didn't matter in the end because he's dead to Arsene back air 75 because, you know, Arsene does that. I was waiting for that. Yeah, it was. Good stuff to he was side being like that. He was doing too many jousting like that. Venom caught onto a new how to punish it accordingly and did just that. Simple as that. Not much to say about it. Not much to say about it. Uh, but I do like at the end, MGW was starting to change up the game plan a little bit, playing a little bit more defensively and waiting out options better. But it was, it was too little, too late.